Hey nerds, welcome to Jerry Bear Reacts. Today we're going to react to Camille O'Connell, A Beautiful Soul. Again, Daddy Negan, 31,000 views posted back September 2021 with a runtime of 3 minutes and 27 seconds. So if you want to watch that uninterrupted, a link will be in the description box down below, as well as a link for the Patreon, the Twitch stream, and everything in between. And with all that in mind, Jerry does his best work behind the scenes. For some reason, I don't know why, but Cammy gets a lot of hate. A lot of hate. I like Camille. Let's get into it. Walking alone at night. She's either brave or dumb. I'd like to talk to you about your niece. You know, it's not safe here alone. Your oldest scotch. The hundred dollar guy. You know I have a black. The hundred dollar guy. Brave bartender. <laughs> Stay away from my niece. Hey, Mr. Oh, Tate. Who the hell's your niece? Cammy. So I'm going to offer you a job. Pain. They were clapping each other up, too. That's my stenographer. Okay, what are we writing? My memoirs. The great evil. Someone should know my story. You are one of these alienists, right? Camille, the brave bartender. Bartender with a grad degree in psychology. Total cliche. We're called therapists these days. Cammy O'Connell, bartender. Oh, a little Will. I forgot about What's Will. Up for your family, has it? The twin brother was a mass murderer. The insane twin brother slaughters nine seminary students and then dusts himself in. When he killed those men, I thought he must be mentally ill. But... The nine churns with nah. the limitations of what happened in this church when my brother cursed. Slaughter spree. Something's not right. I just can't figure it out. What if it was demons? Your twin brother's behavior was not born of natural causes. My brother, your nephew, hexed by a witch. How could you not tell me? It's complicated. What happened to your brother Sean is about to start happening to me. He's going to go crazy and die, isn't he? The great unloved. Just like Sean. You're failing out mixed up in the supernatural world. I just feel bad for Cammy, man, with her brother and everything. But the lies your uncle told. And then Father Kieran. Meant to protect you. He is a good man. Isn't it true that Nick killed Literally, Father Kieran was a great human. You deserved far better than this. Yes, he did. You believe people can change. You're still seeking out Klaus's redemption as if that were a thing that was even possible. The world is a rather awful place. You really said that to him? The world is an awful. People are not awful. They, they want, want to, to be, be good. good. Here's the only family I have left without him. I'm alone. There's a mercy I'm killing. all alone. He knew that this town needed him. The light shines in the darkness. My favorite niece. We still do. Favorite niece. Not hey, your only niece? The father Cheeky K. bastard. Father K. father K. Why do you even care about Kenny? Klaus let you into his life because he trusted you. I trust her. I trust you. You see the good in Nick? The good I see in you versus the horrible things I know you've done. And after centuries on this earth, do you really not see that all of your violence... Rebecca! Enough running, children! It's pointless! Don't become your father. She believes Pointless, bro. Cammy knew about all that trauma. I don't believe in evil as a diagnosis. I like her spirit. The light shines in the darkness. So I wonder if they'll, I wonder the if they'll drop the bar. Not <laughs> Alex, Ray, you're gonna have to think that. I was your father. I see that he wants to be more than what he is. But there is light in you. I guess the great O'Connell family line ended here. You're a compassionate woman. That shit yeah. fucked me up. <laughs> it's your fatal flaw, and it will be your downfall. You can be the light for your little girl. Finally living up to the potential that Cammy saw in you. <laughs> she would have been proud. Hell yes, yeah, she would have. I like where um, Klaus tells her, I will carry you with me forever and cammy says well i guess that makes me truly immortal something along those lines paraphrasing i i read a bunch of comments about people saying that one of the reasons cammy was kind of written off the show was because of hate mail from people who shipped um caroline and, and klaus together i don't i've i've loved a lot of shows like i've i've loved and held breaking bad close to my heart forever and I always will and I could quote you different episodes and tell you the whole story from start to finish it's a perfect show I love Game of Thrones I love a lot of good shows I would never ever 
do some wild shit. Motherfuckers talking about sending death threats and this, that, and the other. You, you, therapy. Even if you don't agree with something they do with the show, if they could have did something completely wild, I'd be like, man, that's crazy. I don't agree with that decision. That's wild. Can't believe they did that. And then go about my day. People are wild. Anyways, I really enjoy Cammie. Um, she was kind of, she was that light for Klaus for a while. She was kind of a rock. and She was kind of the thing that reeled him in when it needed to happen, when, when Elijah wasn't there to do so. And when her, them having that Christmas together and then waking up and then she was all bloody and shit. Oh my God. Pain. Pain. Anyways, I like Cammie. I wish more people like Cammie as well. Camille O'Connell. Brave bartender. I'm going to go ahead and head out. Links and everything will be in the description box down below. Playlist will be up on screen. As always, stay cute, stay hydrated, and I will catch you on the next one.